and welcome back we are starting this new vlog happy Sunday in this August month it is a little overcast it's quite a cozy summer Sunday and we've had just a lovely day of relaxing you have not missed much but I did just get a little bit ready I took some pictures out on the patio with my mom and now I'm about to go get coffee with my dad and bring back some coffee for everyone else so I thought it'd be a good time to vlog we're also going out to dinner tonight Claire stayed overnight which is so fun and this is Elizabeth's last summer weekend so we have just been soaking all of it in we went jet skiing yesterday we had a really fun evening out on the patio with the lights on we had some ice cream so it was just overall 10 out of 10 so right now we're gonna go get coffee I wanted to show you my outfit since it's like kind of sprinkling rain I think it's gonna pass so we're not gonna bring the cushions in but it's like in the 60s so you can just kind of feel that the seasons are brewing right Elizabeth <laughs> and Elizabeth is actually going to a oh hey oh sorry Come on in, I'll stop. So this is my outfit for our cozy Sunday. I'm wearing this sweater, which is from J. Crew. I actually have not worn this all summer. Um, I've actually never worn this before, but I also have it in pink. It was, I just didn't have the right chance for it. It still had a tag on it. Hopefully this is still a sweater that is available at J. Crew, but it's like the perfect sweater for today because you can wear it with shorts and it's like a coastal grandmother sweater end of August, but you're not sweltering, which is great. And then I'm just wearing my little drawstring shorts from J. Crew, and then I paired it with these really cute shoes, which are actually Elizabeth's. They're from uh, Tory Burch, and I love this like brown color. Right here in Elizabeth. Hello, hey. good to see you. Um, Come just... stand over here so we oh, can really. Okay. You look amazing. Elizabeth's Whoa, going to the Surfaces you. concert tonight. I was just actually checking to see if my hair was straight. Oh, it's so straight. You never straighten your hair. But is there like a wave? Right? No, there's okay, no cool. wave. Why don't you share your outfit with everyone? This is Emily's set, and it is from. Um, we got it before Aritzia. Aritzia. So it's just kind of. Oh, you know, it's effortless. Look at this chill. little, little bracelet or little uh, necklace. Necklace, yeah, so pretty, Elizabeth. And then. And then the boots. Those are from the Steve. <laughs> no. I I recall those being taller on us. No? no, that's that's the height. Wow. Okay, we should really get some taller ones. It looks amazing though. You look yeah. so cute. So you're going to the Surfaces concert with some yes. friends, and it starts yeah. pretty early, I would say. Well, you know, it's a Sunday, so it starts at six. Yes. We're I'm gonna leave in like 20 minutes. Mm meet them at their house, drive down together. It's just gonna be really, really I'm so fun. excited for you. It's at Nautica in Cleveland, which yeah. is like an outdoor venue, and we love services. Yeah, we love you, you're so oh, no, you know. <laughs> So that's what she's doing tonight, yeah. which is just fantastic. Um, are you leaving like right now? No, in like 20 minutes. Okay, we're gonna go get coffee, Dad and I. And oh, then I won't see you. Well, I'll be back then. I feel, like, I feel like the hair, I did a middle part, I don't know, I just. My hair is curly today, as you can see, I haven't addressed it. I was getting such kind feedback from the last time that I had my curls, so I just... I think what need, I think this is a problem right here. What is? Like, I think it needs to be a little... Okay, yeah. <laughs> it just passes out for me. It's dizzy. <laughs> Drops the camera. I don't know. It's like very... And then oh, that's, that's pretty. That was oh. pretty. Oh, look at those curls! Do you want me to... Here, give me the camera. I'll show them. You guys are so fun. Okay. It's a little, okay, they're, like, they're really untamed though. They need to be a little bit more. No, tame. but it's so, hold on, let me get this backlighting. I don't actually know how to work this. Here, I can go this way. It's better in this way. <gasps> oh, wow. It's just uh, such a mane. Oh my gosh. You have so much hair. I literally can't even find your face. <laughs> Where is she? Oh, you, Wait, you look like stunning. Like yeah, Emily. You look beautiful, honey. Oh. Stormy baby. Stormy baby. Wait, <laughs> you look like need... mommy. Okay, so... So I wash my hair twice and then I condition it with the essence. Whoa, I just turned the brightness up way too much. Okay, continue. Um, with the essence shampoo and conditioner, is that what it's called, Elizabeth? Inner sense. Inner sense. I didn't know what you were talking which about. Which I will link down below. And then I put the uh, heat protectant in from, which I'll also link down below. And then this, um. <laughs> you can do it. <laughs> The curling stuff, the random yeah. stuff that I bought from Ulta, which honestly, like, it doesn't smell that good, so I need to go back to Ulta and smells find terrible. a better option, and then I just scrunched it, and I let it air dry, and I woke up this morning, and this is what it looked like. Beautiful. So, I mean, who knows if we'll ever be able to recreate this. The The reason why I was shocked that it worked is because typically my curls were formed after I had jumped in the lake, and I went like 40 miles an hour to drive my head on the jet ski. So I thought that the curls were only able to come out when on, I was the, jet on the jet ski. Well, 
we see him now and you were so not a Trotsky. Here. So yeah, that's the whole wow. thing. Wow. Is it good on this side? Or it's, it oh, it's great. <laughs> you just love it. <laughs> I'm going to shower you with compliments. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. No, it looks great every direction. Amazing. Well, thank you for filming me. It was good. We appreciate you and I can't you do for our brand. <laughs> we just went and got some iced coffee before the coffee shop closed. And now we're going to work on some stuff before dinner. Alyssa just left to go to the services concert and it stopped raining, which is pretty nice. So we're just having a cozy afternoon inside i once said it was saturday but it's still sunday so that is the update for right now okay so we are all ready for dinner we're heading out in a moment it's just the four of us since elizabeth is at the concert she'll probably be home like around nine though um wearing this sweater and i'm taking this little basket bag i'll go show you my outfit somewhere okay this is the look really cute sweater from j crew it's actually elizabeth's i think it's still available earrings are from canvas style they were actually sent to me i threw my watch on like i said i'm taking this little dark Darker brown straw purse. This is from, or wicker, I should say. I think this is also from Amazon. It's uh, my mom's white pants. And then I'm wearing my Hermes sandals. So I like that this is like kind of darker with the two. And we're sitting inside at the bar. So it's usually pretty chilly in the bar at the restaurant. So I wanted to make sure, and it's like chilly outside anyway. So I wanted to just be super comfortable. Sunday night dinner with the family, pretty cash. So this is the look, it'll all be linked down below and um, we're gonna head to dinner. Okay, hello everyone. So we just got back from a really fun dinner. It was just like chill vibes, super relaxing, cozy kind of. You can hear the laundry going. We just went for a little walk. Elizabeth is still at the services concert. And I think I'm just going to jam me up. We're going to watch something. I'm going to do some work. I need to finalize things for the podcast tomorrow, which, which always goes live on Monday. So be sure to listen to the most recent episode. I don't know what we're doing tomorrow. Probably just more work, but... We'll be up here for a few days and then we'll go back. Elizabeth is leaving on Friday with my parents to move into Miami. So we will probably have to go back and just like get a few things ready. She's pretty much all set. I definitely want to show you some of the things that Elizabeth, that Elizabeth is putting in her dorm room just because I think that you guys are going to absolutely love it. So original and adorable. So I'm excited to see how her dorm room turns out. Also, something that we were talking about at dinner, which I am excited to document on the YouTube and podcast and everything like that is I need a new car because Elizabeth is taking the Land Rover back and then now that I am just like graduated college and starting to be on my own a little bit more I need a car that I'm gonna be like buying for myself so at dinner tonight we were trying to like brainstorm some ideas of cars that might work for me and I think that after Elizabeth goes back to school we are gonna go to a couple different dealerships and test drive some cars. So I am so excited about that. I have some things in mind, but nothing at all like set in stone. I don't know exactly what I want. So um, we are gonna go test drive some cars. So if anyone has any suggestions for cars that are reliable and you can see me driving, let me know in the comments down below. So this upcoming weekend, my parents are taking Elizabeth to Miami and then we have my grandma's 80th birthday party that Sunday, but my parents are just going like there and back in a day, which is what they did for my sophomore year as well. And it honestly just like works out a little bit better. Joyce is turning 80. Um, so a lot of my cousins will be back at school, but everyone who is home is getting together and we are having a little party for her. So we are just talking about all the exciting things. There's actually so many exciting things happening um, this fall and I'm just looking forward to like the change of pace. It's going to be so different. And I was even saying earlier, I don't know if I mentioned this earlier, but I felt like there was something in the air. Like I remember I felt this last year, the last weekend before I went back to college, I was like, okay, it feels like the end of the summer. I don't know. It's just like a shift happens. And this weekend really felt like okay the last weekend before everybody goes back to school before elizabeth's leaving so i think it was just like a vibe that kind of rolled into the air and i was like okay it's time for back to school and for like me to start this new season of life and i'm just like so excited about it so hi i'm vlogging do you want to come say hi or are you all ready for bed so i think i'm just gonna shower and then we're gonna go downstairs and watch something um but yeah, that was just my little update. We had such a fun dinner and mom's right there. <laughs> so I will see you guys later. Okay, hello everyone. Happy Monday. What a day. I 
I'm sitting on a lounge chair right now. I've been working outside on my computer because I feel like I don't really sit here too often. And we did this over the weekend and it's just such a nice spot under the tree. And I'm working on this big water, trying to stay hydrated. I look a little crazy. Okay. What was that? Uh, is that their mom? Or their grandma? The two little boys are fishing on the bridge right now. I think it's their mom or grandma, Elizabeth. Oh, I thought they were about to get hit. Maybe they are too. No, they're talking at length. I don't know. But Elizabeth's on the porch right now, and we've all just like been in this exhausted mood, being very tired, didn't even particularly have an exhausting weekend, um, but just slept really badly last night. So we are taking, and I went to bed late because like Elizabeth got home late from the concert, so I like stayed up to make sure she was home. So it's just like things of that nature. But I've been working to get the podcast episode up for this week. It's taking particularly long for some reason. We've had to go back and forth a lot with edits. The sound has definitely improved this week. So if you go and listen to it, hopefully you will not be distracted by like the shrieking and the spiking of it. It's definitely way more even and much more enjoyable to listen to. So that's at least good. Um, we've got coffee in the afternoon. That's pretty much all you've been missing. It is a gorgeous day, I will say. Like it's a beautiful day. This is my view right now. Just working on my computer. So I think my mom's, my mom's doing yoga right now. She said she was maybe gonna make a dinner. But yeah, those are just the vibes right now. Um, Ebeth, you have anything to say? Um, I'm just doing a lot of clerical work. I actually can't even see you here. Here I am. Hey, girl. So I was, I just ordered a transcript to go. You from, ordered a transcript? Yeah. Those are the types of online shopping I'm doing right now. Yeah. To go from Tri-C to Miami. Oh yeah, because your summer courses. That was Paid smart. My coyotes. Oh wow. So you're really doing things that. Hello? No. <laughs> Hello. I, are I, um, you tired? I'm so exhausted. Yeah, I don't know what the vibes are, but the little I had a massage. Are. Yeah, oh, you did have a massage. I forgot. Lovely. You did I can that. like move fully, like move my arm. Yeah. That must be a good feeling. <laughs> yeah. My sunglasses are from Crew. They actually sent these to me. I've just never really worn them. So, we don't have much going on right now, but I don't know. It's just very tired i don't think i can stress fatigued. that enough like Lethargic. fatigued i have an excuse because i think my period's starting but i don't know what everybody else's my vibes are is that i was out last night you were out last night yeah but like mom feels this way as well claire said she didn't sleep well either because she stayed with us last night i don't know i mean i was up till one i was up till one too and then couldn't fall asleep so yeah, this yeah, just does. You know? Like, that's just what we're doing. This is real. This is life. <laughs> um, oh. So I might take a nap, actually. I was thinking about just, like, laying down. I'm waiting to hear back from Matt, our editor, because he needs to send me the final edits. But I'm like, if I fall asleep before that happens, like... <laughs> so be it. Like, so be it. Whatever happens, happens. <laughs> yeah. Uh-huh. So. so, all right. We'll talk to you later, hopefully, okay. when we have a little oh, bit more gosh, was... stamina. <laughs> Cousin breakfast at First Watch. Hello, hello and hello. Good to see everyone. Okay, we are in full dorm packing. It is Thursday. We have so many exciting pieces out for Alyssa's dorm. I wanted to pull up the camera and show you some of this. Most of these things are in garbage bags, bedding, linens. A lot of the things are already in the car. Um, she's taking one of these Serena and Lily La Jolla baskets for storage purposes, but there's a bunch of stuff that we're just moving. So that looks fresh and new. And then we have the Target rattan lamp, which I showed in a couple vlogs ago. Just making sure that that's dismantled so it doesn't break on the drive. I'm seeing a lot of rattan baskets over here. Well, where are these from? Um. Or what are they you used know, Mom for? Just gave them to me for the, from the basement. Oh, I don't actually know where cool. they came from. I'll link but, them. No, this is also from Target. Look at this shining, oh, excuse me, shining just moment. Just going around the hall. Just go on a little lemonade stand. This is her bar cart. This is from Target. Like a total Serena and Lily dupe. If you guys have an apartment, a dorm, a house, like this beyond. This is also from Target. Also from Target. And she this had this is last, year. last year. Yeah. 
these are kind of clashing colors, but it's more of like a natural aesthetic. Yeah. Um, Palm Beach. Palm Beach vibes, for this sure. This is what Carlton Barney. This is what he out. wanted. That's your mattress pad right here. Yeah. This is a second lamp that you're going to take, right? Uh, Mom just informed us that this is new. This is a little wand vacuum. And where is this from? Target? Amazon. Amazon. So I'll link that down below as well. She's taking this. Okay, so wait until you guys see what we made this year, what Mom made this year for Elizabeth's dorm room. You're going to throw up. Oh, OMG. Like, Look at this. This is an old tablecloth from the 1950s that we bought at the summer market. Um, and this is of Florida. And this goes perfectly with Elizabeth's Palm Beach in the 50s slash 60s vibe. And so we cut it up because it was a huge tablecloth. And then my mom framed it. She ironed it. And there was even like a little missing part that she put some fabric into it. This looks like you could sell it. So then she just added a little ribbon and Elizabeth's going to hang this. But this is like the showstopper for this year. And it's original because I don't know where you're going to find this elsewhere. Okay, next up for decorations, we have these fans. And these are also from Amazon, right? Okay, so they're not all fans. Oh, well, do you want to share? Sure. Okay, please show us. So it there's many different sizes. Oh my gosh. And then you put them on the wall. This is beyond it's Elizabeth. Very eclectic. We're gonna Look hang them with little commands. So a version of this will be going in your room. Oh, I see the hooks on the back. And then we'll just use a little command hook. Gotcha. So there is a bunch of these in there. So wow, this is like Serena and Lily heaven right here. The next item we have is her headboard cover, and this is or pillow, I'm sorry, and this is also matching with your roommate mini. So you both will have these and this just looks so plush and cozy. I love the white and it's gonna be great up against your bed to give you some height and to make the bed look a little bit more substantial. And where is this from? Well, I think it was like a dorm room website that we could find. Okay, we'll link it down below for you. Okay, this just arrived from Shipped, which is Target's like at home delivery. We got a fern for Elizabeth. We're trying to pull in a little bit more green, some, you know, fake faux plants. And so this is going to be placed somewhere. My mom ordered two. We decided that this one was the better looking faux fern. And I really like this white pot. So again, if you are looking for some greenery in your home or your dorm or your apartment, I will link this fern from Target down below. Okay, the next to me amazing piece that we are sharing is Elizabeth has sconces that will be in her room. These are from Amazon. Again, perfect for uh, apartment, dorm, house. We saw these, I saw these online up against the wall like so, as you can Honestly, see. I like it in our house. The way in which she will be putting them on the wall is with this alien tape, which I will also link down below and it can go on my Amazon shop. And then we have these cord covers, which are also from Amazon, so that you will not see this black cord in the dorm. If you wanna recreate this for your house, your apartment, your dorm, everything will be linked down below. I really think it elevates a space and it makes it look way more substantial. So we are excited to see the outcome of the two sconces. And I don't know if I mentioned this, but she has two. So I don't know if it's gonna be like flanking her bed or wherever it may end up. <laughs> okay, just showcasing some more of her artwork pieces. I'm not quite sure if she's doing, a, are you doing like a gallery wall? So on one side I'm doing a gallery wall by my desk and okay. then I'm doing, or by my bar cart, but then above my bed it's just that one tapestry. Gotcha. Actually, let me show you, let me show you a picture. Okay, so first of all, these two frames we've had before, so I'm gonna link those down below. I'm pretty sure they're Amazon. I love this like gold foil bamboo look. And then these two prints, Elizabeth, where are they from? This is a Matisse. Oh, this is actually from Urban Lux. Oh, fun. And then where's this one from? Urban Lux. Oh, cool. All right, the best part is that she found some vintage postcards at an antique shop, and we went ahead, she went ahead, mom went ahead, I didn't do anything, and framed these. How amazing. This is a little Isn't beach scene. This thing? is This is beyond. from upstate New York. Look, hold on. Okay. Yeah, show us the history. Look. Oh, does it say that? Well, it said it on the other one. Oh, I see. That is precious and then there's this one. <gasps> oh, this is um i think it's a moat like a hotel motel and you just found these at the antique shop yeah and then this is the one that i'm using stop this is actually united church of christ in miami florida wow cool i mean i like the first one actually well i'm not this is just like extra this oh, is I what see. i'm hanging oh this is what she's hanging this is a postcard that we matted right mom yes okay this is adorable i mean this looks like a painting and then frames are just from amazon yeah. Yes. Okay. Maybe we could even put some extra. Oh yes. Like Elizabeth had extra ones. Maybe we we might. Yeah. Like I'm not using those. Ones. So we have a lot of these extra ones, and so we her might nails. do this. She just got her nails done. They look <laughs> amazing. We might do this and start selling them on the website for you guys. This is like the updated retro tennis rackets from last year. So we may be 
uploading these onto my website. I will keep you guys updated. And then she has this knot, which we also got from a local business at the farmer's market. It's called the Knot Company, right? Beagle Bay Knot Company. Beagle Bay Knot Company. You made this. Yeah, guys, I collected these in Palm Beach last time we were there, and I just glued them onto this little baby piece of paper. Amazing. And then where's this from? We antiqued this. This, this is actually giving me like 80s vibes, but it's I cleaned it off. It's a shell. She's fun. She's this fresh. is amazing. You're so this so... is the inspiration. So this is what we laid out. This is going by my bed. Oh, I this forgot about the pennant. Pennant. We uh -huh. ordered on Etsy. Obviously, you just saw that. This and then that. So not everything. I see here is okay. going to be on the bed. Gotcha. So that's what it's going to look like. Amazing. Thank Excuse you for me. clarifying. So we wanted to pull in more green to Elizabeth's dorm. Um, so she has this huge Euro sham, which is from Nordstrom, piped in green. This looks so amazing. And then this pillow is from Serena and Lily. I love the pattern. That's going to be a little accent pillow. And then this blanket is from Amazon. So everything will be linked down below. And then also her, you know, headboard. All this will be going on her bed with her blue bedding from last year. Okay, I've just been informed that these baskets are actually from Walmart, and we used to use these for my pop-up shop. She's just going to bring them to the dorm since they go so perfectly, and they might be great for organizational purposes. As you can see, we have a lot of them, so we're just going to see how she uses them. Okay, so we have more antiques over here. The first two things being these adorable mugs, which we found at that same like flea market. This is straight out of Palm Beach the 50s. So there were two which will be placed out on her bar cart for her and her roommate like so. Amazing. She also antiqued this shell that perhaps will be going on her desk. That's amazing. And then down here we were just kind of, you know, making things up, but they ordered these three monkeys from Two's company, but you had to get them off of eBay, right mom? Yes. Okay, and this is the monkey that she chose because for some reason they're no longer available. You just can't get why. them. I don't know. They are well, they're now an heirloom, <laughs> um, but we got this idea from the colony, right? They have the monkeys. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So did Lily Pulitzer. Oh, and Lily Pulitzer. And then we have that fern from Target, and then this planter might be going here, but this was also antiqued, pulling in that little green. And then there might be like a blue basket for storage, and then up here could be the um, coffee maker, more storage, something like that. So this is just a loose outline and some more pieces that they found. Having a little breakfast brunch. We just ordered acai bowls from our favorite little place. Delicious. It's like banana, granola, strawberry, lots of things. So bon appetit. Hey college gal. She's tucked into bed and I wanted to, I grabbed the camera before I forgot. This is Ebeth signing off. Bitsy C is signing off. This is the first time that I won't be with you for a long period of time like on the blog. I know. It's heart-wrenching. How are the viewers going to take it? I don't know, but maybe you can send in clips from school and I'll just <laughs> randomly insert them in the vlog so they can, we're surrounded by all of her These are the animals. ones I'm not taking. So they'll stay home. Maybe I'll Wade, sleep with a few Wade, of them at Nancy, night. Wade, Sammy, <laughs> Bun, Beatrice, Be uh, Rise. How many are you bringing to school? Show okay. the head of them all, Bun Bun. Oh. This is where it all started. The matriarch. She is the matriarch. Hello, Bun Bun. Braiding the beluga. Braiding the beluga. That's it. Oh, wait. No. That's... Yeah. So they'll stay here and hold down the ground. Throw it at the, um, what is it? The winter home. <laughs> yeah. They, they winter in Cleveland. They winter in Cleveland. <laughs> That's yeah. so funny. So you're getting up tomorrow at like 8? I'm going to get up at 7.35. Mm -hmm. Set my alarm. Get dressed. I'm wearing that um, tennis dress. Oh, cute. Dripping in gold jewelry. Obviously. I want to pack all of the gold jewelry, yeah. so I'm just going to wear it. Yeah, get there. Be square. <laughs> around 12. Yeah. Pack everything. Get lunch. Get lunch. Pack everything, or unpack everything. And then Minnie's coming at 5. Oh, your roommate. Amazing. Yeah. But she's not moving until Saturday. Oh, I see. Okay, so maybe I'll just see her, and then she'll move in Saturday. Are you excited? I'm so excited. I'm so happy for you. Like, I'm just like... Thinking of all the things. Oh my god. What am I going to wear? This is very exciting it's for you. thrilling. Thrilling. We had a fun dinner. I think I'm like ready. For, I'm, you're ready. You know, you've gotten yeah, to the... You said, <laughs> I'm ready for you. No, I'm actually so sad. Oh, heavens. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but I feel like you're ready, so that makes me happy. Yeah. And I'll be back before you know it. Literally. Or not. <laughs> Okay, we'll say bye to the vlog okay, until vlog. until further notice. We love you. Love you. <laughs> <laughs> Boop. Boop. Okay, hello everyone. So we are in my new dorm for sophomore year, 
and just take a look at this. It is absolutely ginormous, 264 square feet. And starting over here, we have the bar cart, and Minnie is bringing her an espresso, and this is her little area for her coffee stuff. We're sharing this bin down below. This is the monkey, as you can see, that we talked about on podcast, the brass shell that we got for $3, and then this Target fern, and then, uh, oh, oh, of course, and then the flamingo cups, which are just delightful. And then we have the baskets, which are also carried over into the other part, the fan, the antique shell, and then the Matisse. And then, then we have this La Jolla basket, which is actually my hamper. So I put my bag mm. in here, so it's really slick. Nobody, nobody would know. And then, back here is my desk. So I put the little Kaya letters up there, really sweet. All of my desk essentials, my vase for my flowers, planner, this, and then, this is just delightful. I don't know where we got this, Amazon? Okay, so we got this from Amazon, and we took some of the pieces and we put it over here to it tie it in. And then, we even put one down as a little coaster. And then, Elizabeth, that is just so over cute. Here. Then, this is the Home Goods dented nightstand. And this is the antiqued green vase, which we will put some sort of thing in. I have my weighted charger. This, get a load of this. Really get close. Gotta get ready. Here. What? Oh, oh my gosh. Only Here a they few were invited. Only to a few. Attend college as a sophomore. The elite came. This yes. is where they reside. I should get a, like a little sign or something. Yes, sleeping. And then my slippers. That's cute, right? My there. housewares. Oh, your shower stuff back there. Shower stuff. Oh, here's your Snacks. weighted. Yes, that's yeah. where it goes. You already said that. And then this is um, clothes in mm -hmm. here. Mm -hmm. Very nice. Um, big deep drawers. And then this is the wait. Let's go bed. to the bed. Look yeah. at that. Oh, I see a little stuffed animal. Oh, oh, oh. here Johnny Brown is. <laughs> and then these are the pillows from last year. This is Serena and Lily. My sham, my sleeping pillow. And then Minnie and I have matching headboards that she picked Headboard out. Headboard pillow. Headboard pillow, sorry. And then this is Amazon green throw, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. matching with Minnie. And then the tapestry, which Emily showed, which is just spectacular. Uh, really, it, I mean, it's hard to do I mean, it justice. pulls it's... in the blue from the bedding and the green. It's, it's spectacular. Yeah. And then over here is like kind of my bath area. Mm. So if I have a shower curtain, this is where I pull it. So it's, <laughs> it's your spa. Stool. It's, it's a spa. spa. My stool my robe and um, flip-flops. And then we don't have closets, we have armoires. Mm. So this is my armoire. Tons of hanging room. Hung the shoes, this is my um, bed, bed desk. tray. Bed tray, thank you. My purse is going there. And then I have some t-shirts and shorts. And then my linens. Oh, of course. Of course, because we are staying at a hotel. I like what you did on top. Oh, you did that. The baskets up mm -hmm. here just in case you know I'm housing some guests or I have some <laughs> overflow and then over here is my this is the bathroom so this is more of like the kitchen. kind of your vanity dressing room okay. right near the dressing kitchen room. it's my dressing room um, and this of course is the kitchen. the kitchen this came from home goods as well and I have blow dryer all the hair essentials. And we did a good job. We plugged in the hair dryer to the back. So you just have to pull it out right. of the drawer and use it. Makeup. This is fantastic. Uh, that, that lamp is. This, we should probably move these. Yeah. Maybe, is it hideous by the bar car? No, I think that's a great idea. Okay. That's Minnie's side over there. It's like mini stuff. And then, I think that's it. Okay, so this is the room for sophomore year. I feel like it really upgraded from freshman year. It is so large. Everything is so curated to match every single thing that I have ever liked. And I'm just really excited for the year to come. Okay, hey guys, happy Friday night. So I'm over at Claire's apartment and we are, she's having some friends over. Um, I'm just hanging out with them. I'm spending the night because today my parents moved Elizabeth into college. Um, I think I inserted clips of her dorm room before this because they took like a video so I could include it in the vlog. So while they are doing that, I came downtown today with Claire. She picked me up. We had a little afternoon together. We got coffee um, and ran some errands. Now she's having friends over. So Connor just got over here. We're having a little cheese board. She's setting up in the kitchen, but I wanted to show you guys my outfit. It's super simple. I'm just wearing this little top, which I'm pretty sure is from J. Crew. 
white pants. I'm wearing my Hermes um, sandals while we're in the house, but then if we go out, I'm gonna like switch into a golden goose. I think someone just got here. And then I'm wearing some hoops and gold jewelry. So a really simple outfit, but I will show you the setup and that is the plan for our Friday. Saturday we are here at this really cute coffee shop just along the way and I'm here with Claire Bear Good morning. We just got these blueberry bagels, which they brought over to us I said I feel like I'm at home right now with the way that they presented this and then a literal trough of coffee I asked for a large just Americana and this is the biggest thing I've ever seen, but I'm so excited to just dive in Okay, hello everyone and welcome to my grandma's 80th birthday party. I wanted to give you a little tour of the Cosmo themed 80th birthday. We are having a family dinner and the decorations are superb, so let me go ahead and show you. This is the table and um, since the Cosmo theme, we have pink and white. So we have this white runner and then my mom put confetti and these little sparkles and then we have actual martini glasses holding some candles and then my mom actually made these arrangements. These are just some pretty carnations and roses from the grocery store and then she tied a little pink bow around it each of the vases so this is just like a little at home floral arrangement which is so pretty she ordered these hats these pink and white striped um, hats and then some napkins and then we have these pink candles in these beautiful beautiful candle holders and so here is all of the place settings we're in the director's room at our country club um and i think that we're gonna i don't know what kind of food we're having tonight but it should be good here's me i have on this little pink dress which is super cute so it's just my mom's side of the family i will link my dress down below and i'm just wearing my emily on bow's earrings my um, bangles which are super cute so this is just the look for tonight it's just this light pink and white striped dress with this pretty collar I've been wanting to wear this dress pretty much all summer and every single time I try to wear it it like wasn't right so now we're wearing it tonight for the Cosmo themed birthday party and let me show you the main event over here so here's a little close-up of the balloon arch it looks amazing pop and Cleveland did this so if you need a balloon arch or a garland or really any sort of installation this is always where we get our balloons from and then here's a little sign happy birthday to Joyce my mom made this on Canva she found this um, graphic of a Cosmo she lowered the transparency and then she put the text and then she just printed this out at Kinko's and then we have a bunch of Cosmos that they've been bringing in so we're gonna start the night off with a little Cosmo and then this is the cake that we got her my mom and I went and picked this out the other day um, gorgeous it has three Three layers of pink flowers I think it's just chocolate and vanilla and then we added this happy birthday sign and these pinwheels and then here's another flower arrangement that my mom made and some pink napkins so that's pretty much the entire setup we're gonna take some more pictures and then we have some gifts over here so look how pretty that is and then we have the fam bam over here who's being quiet as I vlog oh, do you want to I know you're shy I know thing, <laughs> well I was thinking about it it's almost 60 years since I've known Joyce. That's fine. It'll be 59 years September 20th. And I'm happy to have been there for so many birthdays. And to be surrounded by our family like this, nothing could possibly be better. Love, Zell. Thank you. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Cheers. Happy birthday. Okay. <laughs> You know, you get to celebrate, mm -hmm. which is what we're doing right now. So keep that in mind, girls. I didn't know that. Oh, you didn't know? I know. I, I, I mean, I've been to the birthday week a long time. Did you? Well, I thought it was a month. She didn't know. know. Yeah, yeah, I don't know. I heard a month, but I don't know. Oh, she did not. It was like a reduction, right? Yeah. <laughs> Thanks to Anne and Terry for putting this together in the family. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. You are so beautiful. Oh, oh stop. You are gorgeous people, and I love you all. Thank you. Happy Cheers. Birthday. Happy birthday, Joyce. Cheers. Happy birthday, dear the Grammy. Happy birthday to you. Yeah. Woo! Woo! Six, eight. Oh, wow. Yes. I remember being eight. Yeah.
I do. I do. Oh, that looks so pretty. That's so pretty. Woo!